Okay, push in, uh, put the lotion, no, the primer on. Oh yeah, my name is, um, wait, no, we gotta put the primer on. Keep putting it on. Now put the foundation on the mirror, like that, like so. Dab a dab, then you dab dab. You keep dabbing, uh, dabber dabber. A lot of dabs. More dabs. Oh, ooh, what is that? Shade. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, apply with the brush. Just brush on your face. I think that feels comfortable. It must feel comfortable. Those brushes are soft. And the neck, can't forget the neck. Protect your neck. This is concealer. Don't know what it conceals, but it's called concealer. Put it there like a football player. And then there, a little soul patch. A little Hitler stash. Then on the forehead, if you have a big forehead, like so. And here's the, some kind of powder or are you, are you brushing the concealer? I don't know why the powder was poured out. I don't, I don't see any powdering. Did I edit it wrong? No. Okay, keep doing the concealer. Oh, maybe I did edit out all of that powder. Uh, maybe? I'll have to go back. We'll see. But yeah, you know, get that concealer. Conceal um, your face. That was a hair, I think. Maybe a brush, hairbrush. That's gross though. Yucky. Okay, still concealing. I'm gonna put some music under this. I hope my voice is not nice. I don't think it is though. I feel like I sound boring. Oh yeah, I didn't cut out the powder. See, there it is. Look. Yeah, look. Powder. Face. Oh, that's a powder puff. Like in Powerpuff Girls, I see the reference. I get it. I get it. It's a play on words there. It's marvelous, yes. Power puff. Powder puff. Amazing. I like that Rowdy Rough Boys episode. I think they were like boogers and nails. Oh, look at that little dance. Here we're going in with orange. More orange. Was it two oranges or just the one? I think those are two different oranges. But we're going to put them on the eyeball. I mean, the um, eyelid. There we go. Got more orange on the eyeball. orange nice nice color I think I picked these eye colors since I was doing the voiceover picked orange and blue because they're the opposite colors on the color wheel and they do that in movies because it looks cool let's hope it looks cool now Time on this eyeball. Eyelid. Eyeball. Eyelid. Uh, more orange. Nice color. I think I read somewhere that orange uh, makes people feel angry. Not red. Well, I think red makes people feel angry. No, I think I'm wrong. Was it red makes people feel? Oh, okay. Now we're doing more orange, another orange, a lot of oranges. Uh, okay, tap tap. Was this a shiny orange? It might have been a shiny orange. I guess we'll see. Uh, no, this is not a shiny orange. 
like a regular orange. Uh, yeah, yeah, regular orange. Keep going in. This is all part of the blending process, which is important. You gotta do both sides, you know, because of symmetry. So it makes things look nice, symmetry. Yep, look at that symmetry. Now we're doing a red orange. So I had this car, it was red, but Tiffany always said it was orange. It was definitely red. It says it on the title and everything, red car. She says it's orange, so I think she's a little color blind. Blind. I didn't say blind, I said blind. So we're putting on more orange. That car is definitely red, by the way. Like I pointed out to one that was the exact same model. And she was like, hey, look at that red car. And I was like, hmm, yes, red, isn't it? That's right, red. But yeah, yeah. Oh, now we're at the shiny orange. <laughs> what was that? Panic? Is the orange too shiny? No, it looks good. It looks good, I like that. You like that, America? I like it. <laughs> okay, more shiny orange. I guess she liked it. <laughs> I don't think you need to have your mouth open like that when you put um order. <laughs> okay, now we're on the blue. Blue is my favorite color. It is also Tiffany's favorite color. Fun fact. science teacher, chemistry teacher in high school said blue does not exist naturally in the world. And then everybody started naming blue things that happen. I like this this blue right here. Well that's not natural. But then somebody said blueberries and then my science teacher was just like well um uh, uh and it was really awkward but it was funny at the same time. I always remember that when I started thinking about blue a lot. It was, it was nice though. It's not really blue blue, it's coming out like teal. Is that teal? Aquamarine? What is that? It's like a light blue. She's spacing out. Look at her. She's just lost. Okay. It's blue. What's the color I'm thinking of? I wish I need more color names. Not the basic ones. Not the ones that come in the printer like cyan. That's supposed to be yellow, isn't it? the same shiny orange. No, it must be a different one. Put it right there. I should need to put it right there. It's, it's part of the eye. Oh, it should be nose. Well, now we're on to the uh, mascara. Get them, them, those lashes. Get them lashes popping. Yeah. Volume. I learned that in the commercial. The lashes volume. The under lashes look scary. I wouldn't want to poke my eye. So this is the stencil. What's the word? There's a word for that thing. Well, this is a pencil. I know that. You can just draw in there. All those years of drawing and lines in elementary school definitely paid off here. Look at that. Look at that precision. Look at her go. Oh, she told me she cried here. And she takes it out with the beauty blender. So it doesn't ruin the makeup. I wonder what she was crying about. She didn't really poke herself. Thank you. Why are you sad? Why aren't you? It wasn't me. This is, she said, highlighting powder. So you, you put it there to highlight, and it's a powder. I think that that was the, was that maybe that was bronzer. Is that bronzer? We'll see. Yeah, 
Yeah, it was. Wait. Is it? Yeah, yeah. I think it was. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Because she puts it on her forehead. She has a big forehead. I'm dancing. Yeah, keep dancing. Good for your health. This is blush. Keep the cheeks rosy. Rosy blush. Put over there. Tap tap. Tap tap. I don't know what this is. Oh, that's highlighter. I do know what that is. Because it's shiny. Highlighter is always shiny. Unless it isn't. But it's still highlighter. That's uh, uh, more eye shadow stuff. This is chapstick. So it's easier to put on the lipstick. Is it chapstick? I've never seen a chapstick like that before. Might be chapstick. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say it's chapstick. We'll agree on that for now. Rub it in, and this is lip liner. She's not really lining the lips, though. It's kind of. It should be maybe. Now nah, she's doing alright. She's doing alright. Cut some slack. And put this lipstick on. More shiny stuff. Everybody likes shiny, right? Shiny things are usually good. Can't think of a shiny thing that's bad. I guess mercury. Mercury is shiny, but you don't really want to touch it or eat it, so that's bad. We found one. We got it. You got to make the duck face. I think that's the, the only way you can apply lipstick is gratuitous duck face. Looking at ourselves, we look amazing. We look pretty, beautiful. More duck face. Uh, do this thing with the finger. Think so you can get lipstick on your teeth, right? That doesn't sound pleasant. But lipstick tastes weird. Maybe like crayons, like shiny crayons. More dope face. Okay, I got everything. Alright, yeah, the setting spray. More taking a ew, what? Your finger taste bad? What was that? I always feel like she puts on way more setting. What was that spray than you need? Like it's like that's a lot, right? Isn't that too much? It looks like too much, but I guess it's the right amount. And then you got a fan. <laughs> and then you got a <laughs> you got a choke. <laughs> fan it off, and then there we are. Thanks for watching everybody. My name is Brooke. I did the voiceover. Hope you guys like it. Comment, like, subscribe. And we're definitely going to do more videos. Thank you.